what really sets our modern age apart from um, older times is uh, quantum mechanics. Mm -hmm. And from quantum mechanics has, everything else has changed, you know, chemistry and biology and cosmology, you also have quantum cosmology and so on. Now the creator of quantum mechanics, Erwin Schrodinger, he was a Vedantin, he was an Austrian, he was right. a Vedantin. And in his own autobiography, he says that, look, uh, the central idea of quantum mechanics came to me, he says, from the Upanishadic Mahavakya, I am Atma Brahma. That this Atman is the entire cosmos. So the central idea of quantum mechanics is that this quantum state, a quantum state means a description of a physical system at its most elementary level, is a superposition of all possibilities. You know, mm -hmm. it's like normally you're wearing shoes. Your shoes can be brown or black or they're colorful, they can be blue or red or whatever else, but they can't be brown and black and blue and red at the same time. Correct. But in quantum mechanics, that's what you have. You mm -hmm. have a system which is all these mutually exclusive things at the same time, same time. all the possibilities, mm -hmm. right? Which is what this idea of how can the Atman, which is the smallest and the small, right? Can be equal to the entire Brahman. And mm -hmm. you have all these paradoxical statements in the Upanishads or in the Vedas, right? Um, um, or in, uh, you look at Ishavasi Upanishad. It's the smaller, smaller than the smallest, bigger than the biggest. biggest. Uh, this Atman is, right? That Isha is. So this particular uh, intuition is the heart. The second part of quantum mechanics. Now I'm teaching you quantum mechanics after this. You can tell others that you know quantum mechanics. As no well. quantum mechanics. I'm an expert. <laughs> <laughs> the second part of quantum mechanics is you have all these superpositions in reality at the same time. But when the mind interacts with this reality, then mind has access to only one of these. One of these, right. Only one of these. So and in quantum mechanics, that's called the collapse of the wave function. Mm -hmm. Now, in... Um, in Vedanta, uh, the mind is like the observer. The mind is the observer because the mind has ego, ahankar, and Sakshi. everything else. Sakshi, right. Right. Yeah, Sakshi. Well, there are two. Uh, mm -hmm. In the in the Veda, it's uh, spoken about Dva Suparana. There are two birds on the same branch. Right. One, one of them, is eating. One of them is only watching the Sakshi. Eating. The other is enjoying. Right. Right. So you have the mind and the Atman. So the Atman is also like the light, right? So the, what falls in the mind becomes, uh, becomes physically distinct. Mm -hmm. In Atman, you have everything. Mm -hmm. It has its infinity. But what the light as it falls on the mind becomes embodied. And therefore only one of the, uh, or, or a countable, number of possibilities of the become one, become one infinity so from many it becomes one within mm -hmm. us and and that is the very heart of quantum mechanics mm -hmm. and this is what opens up everything and that is the foundation mm -hmm. that you have in the vedas you know or you have in the bhagavad gita krishna's saying since your name is krishna as well <laughs> <laughs> krishna's saying that i'm within everybody yes Right, or you can use either Krishna's image um, or Shiva. They're the same. Hari Hara, right? One, or depending upon how you, what your oh. temperament, temperament in relation to how you want to relate to the mystery. You yes. can either relate through through the power of uh, of yama and niyamas, of rectitude, of mm -hmm. morality. That is Krishna or you can do it through freedom, mm. um, uh, pure freedom, that is Shiva. And freedom has two aspects. It has the fierce has aspect, which is Rudra, Rudra or Aghora, or it has the pleasant aspect, which mm. is Vamadeva or Parvati. You know, it has both aspects. Freedom has both aspects. It has heat, you know, before it becomes light, it has, you know, when you burn something, firstly, it's hot, you can fingers can <laughs> Can get burned. That is the raudra part. Mm. But then the light emerges 
which is the the beautiful part beautiful which part. is what uh, liberates us please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel for our other social media links more content and to support our work please visit citti.net dhanyawad namaskar